A dominant force in the women's division. Absolute sheer aggression. The following is a triple threat match. Making her way to the ring from Ayrshire, Scotland, Piper Niven. Niven has made it very clear as of late. Whatever she wants, she will take. You're not kidding, Saxton. She basically declared herself a tag team champion. And the funny part was, nobody objected. Piper Niven looking to make a name for herself tonight. Here comes Raquel. And her opponents, first from Rio Grande Valley, Texas, Raquel Rodriguez. Raquel seems to always wear a big smile, just loves to perform for the crowd. Yeah, but if you get on her bad side and that smile vanishes, you are faced with an angry woman with muscles for days. The personification of dominance in NXT and WWE since day one. Yeah, and I think we can all agree that Raquel Rodriguez is getting better with every match. Even when she makes short work of her opponent. Already so many accolades for this woman, Bianca Belair. And from Knoxville, Tennessee, Bianca Belair. Hey, Bianca, make such a confident entrance. Let's be honest, it's because Bianca Belair realizes exactly how great she is. Uh, uh, um, Corey, not just great, the greatest. Get it? Listen to this ovation. The WWE Universe loves cheering on the EST. Well, come on. Her energy is just infectious. I see Graves even dancing over there. Uh, I'm not sure I'd call that dancing. We've got triple threat action here tonight. No disqualifications, no countouts. This is a match that favors the opportunists. There can only be one winner, and the one who strikes at the right moment will score that impressive victory here. Submission, the goal, and for some reason, she lets go of the hold. Could have just been a tease of the potential agony that's yet to come. And as dangerous as she is, that kendo stick just made her even more so. Looking for the sidewalk slam. Double axe handle smash. Oh, my Lord. Uh-oh, this is not going to end well. Big time power. That was a powerbomb with one message in mind. Absolute destruction. And then the power slam to follow. And back in the ring we go. Oh, what a clothesline. What a clothesline. Ouch. Good Lord. Corey, so many things 
can transpire in a matchup like this. What could be that elusive X factor? It is mission critical to be adaptable. If it's anything goes, then use that to your advantage before your opponent does. This is an environment where a competitor can be reminded real quick what goes around comes around. And you might be forced to revamp your strategy when you least expect it. Swing for the fences with a kendo stick. Send your opponent crashing through a table. Fight up the ramp. Whatever insanity you can come up with is fair game. Was definitely not thinking about finesse with that one. Was only thinking about dominance. Oh. Simple but effective. Man, what a slam. The fatigue is setting in for her. That's the kind of physicality we can expect from Piper. Raquel has nothing but absolute destruction on her mind. Just looking for ways to wear out her opponent. Oh my goodness, nasty line. Both arms trapped, and what's next? Ooh, headbutt from the rear. And now she's getting back into the ring. In and out. Wow, what a lariat. Getting carried around. Bad spot to be in. Right across the larynx. Close line. Oh, that'll leave a mark. Going for the ride. The follow-away slam. Power like that might be the great equalizer. Big time spine buster. Could lead to a big time win. Piper taking a step back and measuring her opponent. <laughs> I honestly can't believe we just saw a human being tossed like that. And just being tossed away there. And that was a well-executed attack. Big right hand. Waist lock. Able to counter. Look at fighting out. Manages to fight out with a series of punches. Look at the power of Raquel Rodriguez. Has her opponent up and a goalie bomb. Oh, catches a kick to the face. Oh, using the knee as a weapon. With no countouts, there's nothing keeping her inside the ring. The universal signal for extreme. The kendo stick has entered the fray. She's taking a beating here. Yeah, triple threat matches are no cake. She thinks she has it. Shove her up, and the referee ends the count. Just using the adrenaline to stay in the match. We're no closer to a winner just yet. Quick return to the ring. And Raquel Rodriguez with an epic ball. Niven in big time jeopardy. Up and oh, knee right to the spine. Ooh. She manages to get control. Power slam. And the count's broken, keeping the match alive. It's not over yet. Into the corner now. Running hip attack. What impact. Powerless position to be in right now. Ooh, nasty shot. The pin and the win. Yes. Oh, and that will keep Rodriguez at bay. And it's an open driver. Piper got all of it. Rocked with the point of the elbow. Well executed takedown. Piper taking a step back and measuring her opponent. She will wisely return to the ring now. Alive. Big form. I am stunned by what we've seen from these women so far. These 
competitors are redefining, digging deep and giving your all. That's how you wear down your opponent. Crank in the head. Picking up speed off the rope. Oh, clearly hoping something nefarious is beneath the ring. Uh oh. I don't know what she has planned with that kendo stick. Not sure how much more Bianca Belair can take. I don't think she even knows where she is at this point. with a crucial elbow. She wants it one more time. Powerbomb dropped it. Rodriguez has this wrapped up. Bianca Belair has her in position. KOD. Does that finish Raquel off? Come and there's the breakup. Just in the nick of time. She's into the ring again. Ooh, goes tumbling to the outside. Knife edge chop echoing through the arena. My goodness, did you hear that chop? Raquel left an opening. Bianca Belair scoops up her opponent and making it look easy. And then a power slam. Hoisted over into the gory special. Could be looking for a submission here. Oh, this is so painful. The gore. Raps thinking something else here. Not sure why though, Michael. She seemed to have it really cinched in. Ooh. Ooh. Now we'll give her something to waylay her opponent with. Bringing a steel chair into play here. And what a throw that was. Glory slam. Is it enough? The cover. She pops the shoulder up in one. Wow. I thought for sure that was it. Bianca wobbly looks vulnerable. Piper taking a step back and measuring her opponent. Boom! Nice. Returning to the ring now. Lifted high into an electric chair position. Into an electric chair face buster. My goodness. Oh, kick to the face. Look at it. She's got to be proud of herself tonight. Here is your winner, Raquel Rodriguez. The WWE Universe showing appreciation as all three competitors after an amazing triple threat match. Triple threat matches tend to live up to the hype, and this one was no different, you guys.